Yellowstone Volcano Magma is heating the boiler. Experts estimate recharging chamber. Yellowstone Volcano experts have found new ways of estimating how much bubbling magma is seeping into volcanic chambers deep below the Supervolcano National Park. Researchers at Washington State University and the University of Idaho have found a new way to estimate how fast magma is recharging beneath the Yellowstone supervolcano. Unfortunately, the findings will not help the volcanologists predict a Yellowstone eruption, which some believe is overdue. But the outcome of the study will help better understand how pools of basalt magma recharge the volcano. Peter Larson, Washington State University School of Environment, likened the recharging process to burning fuel underneath a pressurized boiler. The Yellowstone expert said, it is the coal in the furnace that is heating things up. It's heating up the boiler. The boiler is what explodes. This tells us what is heating up the boiler. Dr. Larson, alongside his colleagues, looked at a plume of basalt magma, a molten rock rich in iron and magnesium, heating up a silica-rich rhyolite rock. The volcanic rhyolite is what typically blasts to the surface in the event of a volcano eruptions. Dr. Larson said, this gives us an idea of how much magma is recharging the volcano every year. The startling finding was published in the latest issue of the science journal Geosphere. In the study, the researchers injected a number of hot springs across Yellowstone with deuterium, a hydrogen isotope, to calculate the amount of water and heat leaking from the springs. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.